Welcome back from more Horizon Forbidden West, ladies and gents. What are you doing well? My name is Louis, aka Man, you man here. So in this final episode of my playthrough, my first ever playthrough of Horizon Forbidden West, I'm going to grab that Platinum Trophy and not really completing the game because there are still so many side quests there, but at least I can complete the trophy list and then afterwards I can just roam around the world and upgrade, be obsessed with upgrading my gear my weapon, my outfit, and also there are so many, so many side quests left to do. Currently there are definitely over 10 side quests on my map that I haven't touched yet. Um, but yeah, with that being said, let's crack on with today's platinum list, platinum run. So what, are, what I got to do today is one of the cauldron I still need to do. And I need to do uh, all the defeat all the rebel camps and outposts. And I also need to do one of the quests in San Francisco that relating to flying. You know, so I got the sun wings now. And lastly, it is the machine strike. So machine strike is a board game within Horizon Forbidden West where you can like control machine as like chess pieces, and then you can have different attack pattern attack level, defense level, terrain and all that stuff. So it's like a mini game within the game. Uh, you know, think of it like The Witcher 3 with the card game, the, the Gwyn card game. Um, so it's like that, but in more of a chess style. So anyway, let's crack on with this. Let's get that platinum. Let's have that little bing on the screen notification. And let's go. Ah. Barren Light. Haven't been here in a while. So this is one of the uh, starting area of the game. And there's this machine strike no dude. Strike? Anyone? I'll play strike with you. So back in uh, Chainscrape, they do like a whole tutorial for it. And basically teaching you how to do it, how to do this, how to do this. So hopefully I still remember how to do this. Um, but... Yeah, I mean, how hard can it be? It's only for beginner. I have bought some uh, strike pieces. So this this game is called Strike. Each of the each of the little machine is called Strike pieces. So create a new set. Uh, how many can I do? Okay. And you can see that there's like victory points. I think if you get to like six victory points, then you win the game. That's how they do it. So I want my Ravenger. Um, the scrapper. So I've got two borrowers, two scrappers, and a Ravenger. So I, I bought a few pieces. At the start, I think you only have the borrower um, and the spikes knock, I think. No, I think it's the grazer. It's one of them, you know. So you can see that on the um, bottom left of the icon, you can see the little pointy thing, the blue pointy thing. That's the armor. So you, if you, if they directly attack that front on, basically you are protected. And then there is all sorts of attribute at the bottom, um, saying three melee attack, two range attack. You can move two times, and you got five health and all that stuff. Um, this is difficult. I remember playing the the board the the with the tutorial. Like it's it's still very difficult. So, right, let's start the challenge. Um, they will place the pieces wherever they want. Um. So there are some pieces that you can't get into. There's the whole technical. It's 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 whole very very technical. Scraper. So I've got a couple of my snipers out the back. Do I know what I'm doing? No, 100%. I do not know what I'm doing. Okay, I can do this. Well, that's a big move. Okay. Yeah, you can change the view. Nice. So that's a borrower and that's a long leg. Oh, uh, the scrapper can only do range attack, okay. 
Robert the Ravenger as well. Okay. You can also exhaust your. Um, you can also exhaust your 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 pieces as well. So then you you move. Um, you can move one more square, but then you also take health. Um, so I think the borrower would be good to. It's going heads on about that to that dude, which I'm not happy about, but. The scrapper. Through. Damn. That's a really good move. You return. There you Let's go. Get that piece out of there. So yeah, I need uh seven, seven victory points. Okay, so I can only move two pieces at a turn. Oh, that's not good. Shit. Oh, shit. Not my Ravenger. Oh, they're going for my Ravenger. It's all you. Oh, wow. One down. Okay, because if they manage to take my Ravenger, then um, they he has immediately have four victory point. But I think they might be able to take me. Hopefully not. But I need to get rid of that guy. Uh, no, Boro is gonna do. Ain't gonna do shit. Ah, oh, yes, perfect. This isn't going well for me, is it? Nice, nice. The scrapper did the job. Um, I kind of want to overcharge my Ravenger so then I can move it out of the way. Yeah. I'll move my Ravenger out of the way. Um, so then they don't get the four points. If they destroy my scrapper, they only got two points. But then I have all my chess pieces there ready to strike. So I, I think he might play defensive now. That's that's a huge advantage. Okay, I was not expecting that. Ah, oh, perfect. Oh, perfect. I won the game. What a move. What a move indeed, my man. Hey. Well played, friend. Mm, mm, Enjoy your mm, victory. Mm, 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 mm. Defeated machine strike challenges. Well, only only needed to defeat two. There are definitely a lot more uh, intermediary and 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 hard difficulty opponent out there for the machine strike. And uh, on each hunting ground, you can buy new strike pieces so that's where i got the ravengers and that's where i got the scrappers um it 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 can be very fun if you fully invested in it and have the pieces that you have my chess pieces is probably a little bit too dominant a little bit too op for the beginner uh level but definitely, I have fun. So you guys have a little feel of what it like, what what it's like, and um, and yeah, got a trophy out of it. So let's crack on with the with the next one, which I would do is the cauldron. There you go. So we found the cauldron. Um, this is the last cauldron, also the hardest one, I believe. Yeah, the level forty. So this is cauldron kappa, and uh, the entrance has already been guarded by snap mall and. And that looks like a um, a rock fella. Is that is that the name? 
So a shell snapper. Okay. So what is he? Not good with acid. Great. Not good with fire. And we got some borrower there as well. Um, a dead ravenger. I can grab the uh, the weapon from the ravenger maybe. And then I need to find the entrance. Okay, so let's start. Let's start by getting rid of the barrel barrel. Yes, you do. Okay. Uh, I probably want to get rid of the snap mold first. So. The shell snapper. Oh, I want to get rid of him first, actually. Focus shot. Oof. That was nice. Right. Oh, um, you remember in the last episode I said that the uh, the sun the the sun seeker hunting bow that I had is really good, and then I on the arena I look at the the weapons in the arena, and one of the prize medal prize from the hunting ground is this martial hunting bow, and it is significantly better. So I already bought a few things. I got. I got, yeah, I got carried away, um, but... Um, right. Oh, he saw me. Alright, let's get rid... Let's get rid of you first then. Oh, shit. Oh, that's, that's a lot of damage. Okay, I do need to be careful. I need something fire for that snap mole. Uh, I still got my Sun Touch Hunter bow, not Sun Seeker. Yeah, I might need to use the trip caster actually. Oh, bloody hell, they got here quick. Almost. Ah, there he is. God damn it. Blow you up. How are you not dead? There you go. Okay, the Rockefeller is coming. Rockefeller? <laughs> the Shell Snapper. Okay. So the Shell Snapper is not good with uh, acid, so that's what I'm going to do to it. Hello, motherfucker. And then what I'll do, I'll do... Ow. Oh, he's pissed. Oh, that's a lot. That's hugely damaging. Ow. 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 No, the frost blasting doesn't work. Come on, I snipe you out here. Oh. Uh, 
sticky bomb. Damn, he just doesn't die, does he? Made it a lot more difficult than it, it should have been. Right, the cauldron. Ah, this one I might need to go underwater. It looks like. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I can't. I forgot how cool being underwater is. I can't find it underwater. I just slipped past it. This kelp might give me some cover. Yeah. Stealth kelp will hide you from underwater enemy. Okay, that's not what I have in mind. I thought I could, uh... uh... I need to think about where I need to go before I swim, swim around like a fucking loony. Ah, I guess I just keep swimming down. Looks like I can swim down from here. Oh, that's so cool. Look at the amount of fish in here. Ah. Oh. God damn. Yeah, it'll be fine. So the snap mall is basically a crocodile animal. Oh, this is so cool, man. Tap tap L three while swimming to swim faster. I didn't know that I need to tap it. Oh Jesus. Let's go up. Oh. I'm in. Time to find the core and get those machine overrides. Indeed, indeed. That crate. Might be able to use it to climb onto the ledge. Of course, of course that's gonna happen. All right, I need to find another way up there. There's the core. All right, no, that's the core, ladies and gents. So before we get to uh, override the core, there's a little bit of a Puzzle element, I reckon. Oh my god. Alright, ladies and gents, finally. I can't fight that thing in all this water. I need to hurry. Whoa. Return to the pump room. Get anywhere near the 
Okay, wow, this is turned into a bit of a nightmare. So this uh, cauldron is full of water. It's basically like a, a pump room in a way. So it, it builds all the um, it builds all the water. So I need to lower the water now, so then I can fight that thing. Um, but I don't remember where I. Whether or not I can go back to ah, there you go. Maybe you can help me out. I can open that, lower the water, and then we will fight him. It's pretty cool though, you know. I've gone through the puzzle, and it was all right, you know. Oh, look at that lighting, the shadow, the reflection. Anyway, let's go. And I'm back here. Hundred sure percent. It's just the fact that the the dev has put in so much like design into this underwater section. It's incredible. We lower the water a little bit, so we should have enough um, enough ground to attack him. Yes, we can. Now we do this on my terms, is what Aloy said. Hell yeah! Oh, that's cool. There's some butterflies on that. Here we go. Apex Tyrupper. Weak against. Okay, food time. Can I not activate it? I can. Yes. Let's go, Valatan. Out. Got a couple more. Shit. Ran out. That's what happened when you run out. Right. One day he's got a fucking tie ripper. I need I need to tear that off. There you go. Finally. Can I not do a uh, critical attack? I don't think so. Oh my blimmin'. Ow, whoa, 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 calm down, calm down. I need the thing. Haha, yes. Right, well, I'm gonna do double notch. Double notch on this. Got your fin, bitch. Mm, not much there. Ow, got whacked to hell. Oh shit. Fuck me. Okay. Ah! 
Oh, 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 wow. Last a lot of attack. Let's go. Power shot. How did that miss? All right, final shot, final shot. Give it a rest first till I get my stuff. See you later. Ooh. We're done here. Last arrow and everything. Oh. God damn. Got a lot of loot for that. That's for sure. Let's override the cauldron. All calls overridden. Hell yeah. So now I need to go back to the base and then I can use my fabrication to unlock the override completely. So there's like a two step thing now instead of um, just overriding the call. That's, that's alright. That's, right. that's cool. It forces you to, to go against the enemy, grab the resources, and then you can um, override it. So all the all the big enemies basically. Slaughter spine. Open doors. We should bring the outside. That's the cauldron done, ladies and gents. That's one more platinum trophy. That wasn't really too difficult. Um The tie ripper is pretty good, but this cauldron you can in and out to release aquatic machines. It can electrocute him quite. Smart. It, you can electrocute him quite like quite easy. So. Whoa, that's a lot of XP, a lot of skill points, and now we are level forty nine, ladies and gents. Very close. Forty k more XP, and then we would be. Level 50 and job done for another trophy. Ah, oh, look at that outside. Oof. Golly, look at this sand when <laughs> that's incredible, man. That's awesome. And the sand is a little bit wet because, um. Uh, Aloy is wet, so it's dripping water into the sand, and the sand forms a little bit. Ugh. This game is beautiful. But anyway, what we're going to do now is a flying mission in um, Legacy Landfall. So basically this little part is San Francisco, and uh, we're about to uh, explore what really is San Francisco. What level of it, I guess. Alright. This is Legacy Landfall, ladies and gents. So these are the new people, the new tribe called the the, the Quen, and uh, they were having a uh, basically they, they they got here to find out a way to save their homeland. Um, I'm not going to go into the story at, at all. So yeah, so this is the dilapidated ruin of San Francisco. I promise you. We'll find a way home. Harriam, we're never getting that gyro compass back. We're stuck here. For good. Gyro compass. The ancestor reborn. May we be led to truth. Just Aloy. Just Aloy. What's this I hear about you never going back home? Hello, just Aloy. <laughs> Our navigational ships went home with Overseer Bohai. 
We were entrusted with the one instrument that can guide the remainder of the expedition back across the ocean, and now it's broken. There is one ship that might still hold a working gyro compass. But it's beyond our reach, beached on an island surrounded by deadly currents. No compass, no way home, no way back to those we should have never left behind in the first place. Christia. That's a little bit bleak. Left someone behind. My uh, wife, Neandra. She works the field in the Great Delta. When I was chosen for this mission, she begged me not to come. She just listened to her. Turn. Like she's got always, some big she arrows. Right. She's carrying some big arrows on her back. Goodbye, and <laughs> Look at that. Know, Massive. See her again. So you two are soldiers? Navigators, actually. I'm Harriam. And this is Christia. So you two know how to use this instrument? A gyro a compass. compass. Only I know how to read it. The Diviners trained me. Harriam was chosen to memorize the charts found in the Legacy. So you can't navigate the fleet without each other? It is the Quen Way. The greater mm. the knowledge held by one person alone, the greater the risk it'll be used against the Empire should we be captured by our enemies. Wow. Your tribe sure is... cautious. Very cautious. I want to meet this tribe. So what you have a glimpse of that in the, in the story, but you don't really get into it's the to this tribe. It's by the ancestors to help pinpoint a ship's location, but it only works if the readings are compared to a chart. How'd you get your hands on something like that? I guess it's safe to tell you since you carry the gift of the ancestors. The diviners found them on ancient vessels back in our homeland and modified them so we could use them on our ships. Without them, we're at the mercy of the seas. That's why we carry backups. Unfortunately, this one was damaged. It was damaged. Was going on, no one noticed. Kaput. And now it's too late. If it's kaput, you said we, we will save somewhere. it. Yes. The ship we were stationed on. The night we approached landfall, a sudden squall hit the fleet. While some ships managed to find safe harbor here, ours ran aground. The crew abandoned ship, hoping the ocean would spare us. I thought we'd drown for sure. Thank the ancestors, we somehow got washed up on a beach southwest of here. Scouts found us and brought us to landfall. We were chosen to stay behind with Diviner Alva, to ensure the rest of the expedition can make it back home when needed. Not that it matters. The only ship with the gyro compass is grounded and surrounded by deadly currents. Yeah, Aloy is not afraid of currents. Not unless you can fly. What if I told you I can use one of those sun wings to take me there? You could do that? Why not? <laughs> She's an ancestor reborn. Ancestor reborn. Anything is possible. The ship lies on an island east of here, past the fleet. All right, then that's where I'll go. I will not let myself hope just yet, but I thank you for your kindness. Hey, believe in Aloy. She saved your world. All right, Sunwing. Let's activate the side quests. The way home. Oh, I'm getting crap loads of XP for this one as well. Ten thousand. That's good because I need every single XP that I can get. Um, sweet. Just right there. Sunwing, darling. Oh, Sunwing, darling. Can can the Sunwing grab me when I'm? No. So I've got the sun wings taking me to a journey. Oh, look at the current, the sea, the waves, all the ships. I think this game will hold out very well, like even just five, six, seven years later. In a way, it's like The Last of Us on the PlayStation 3 still hold up very well. What are you? Snap more. Uh, I need to make it blow up. Machines. Better be careful.
Oh, that's not what I was wanted to do. God damn. Aha, burn, biatch. Ow. Whoa, you just teleported. Spray shot. Nice. Oh, ow. Hey, yo, 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 calm down, calm down, calm down. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry. Whoa. Bouncing bomb. There you go. Right, clean half. Ow. Oh, there you go. One shot and then you're dead. This is another snap mold. No, is that... Is that snap mold? It is. Ow. Water canister. There you go. That'll make things easier. Right. That would make things easier. Just look for the coin's gyro compass on that rack. I'm guessing is uh, more climbing. Should be able to look for that gyro compass with my focus. Gyro compass. Oh, there's no compass here. The machines could have scavenged it out of the wreckage. I should check any scrap piles up there in the other, just to be sure. I'll shake it out as I go. There are some good old treasure though. There's a lot of treasure. Don't mind if I do. We just tell them that, yeah, there's no treasure. It's been scavenged by machine. God damn, there's a lot. Okay, that's all it is. Something is pinging down there, so I'm guessing... Could that be what I'm looking for? Nope. I like resources. I don't mind resources at all. There's one more there, but it's only... It's only like a common one. Oh, bloody hell, that's, that's just floating. Wow, it's here long enough that it, it, it grown some fucking moss already. Right, uh, so I need to search for the scraps. Scavenger scraps. Some wing you keep flying, my man. Could it be here? Oh, gyro compass. Yeah, nice. This thing took a beating. Not sure it still works. Better take it to Harry and Christia. Okay. Can fix it. We. Oh, that was a long one. So without the uh, Sunwing, I wouldn't be able to do this mission because I wouldn't be able to um, to swim all the way through this current. It's just gonna pull me into a uh, into oblivion, really. Better yet, yeah, pull you back to shore, but I don't think that would be possible. Right, let's drop down where they want us to drop down to.
nice something. If only I can like pet him, that that would have been quite good. I know he's only a machine. Why are you petting a machine? Well, because it's cool. God damn, that was generous. Couple of data points here. I don't even know how how the hell do I. Uh. Wee. The living ancestor. They do have some pretty good armor in here, if I remember correctly. By the ancestors. By the ancestor. Is that? I'm sorry. It's broken. Our last hope. No. There has to be a way to fix it. How? We just need to replace the batteries and the sensor unit. Right, because they're just lying around a jungle for us to find. Wait. She's so negative. The ancient fleet. Oh gosh. It might have what we need. What ancient fleet? When we abandoned our ship, we were washed ashore on a beach southwest of here. There were ships built by the ancestors there. Mm. We should go check them out. Some summary? For everyone's sake. If anything happens to us, they won't have any navigators to guide the rest hey, of Hey, you, you just want Aloy to do all the job no for you. That's fine, just say it. Just say it, mate. I can get them for you. You'll need to look for a sensor unit. They're usually on a ship's antenna. And okay. batteries. Three of them. They're small. Free so AAA battery. <laughs> I've got something for that. We put our faith in you once again, Ancestor. Hey, Aloy delivered, didn't she? Go to the ancient shipwreck site. So all the way in the west here. So at the beginning, I used this boat to uh, get to the get to the uh, the island, San Francisco. So that's why I unlocked the uh, campfire there, and uh, the way home. Okay, cool. Let's go. Let's go, baby! So this will be a quest of a lifetime. I thought that was um, a bit easy, to be honest. But now there's a part two of this. I love how easy it is as well, just to call your call your Sunwing and then it just picks you up. That's good. Oh... Slaughter Spine. That does not look like a ship, but that's a Slaughter Spine. Even more... I'll find any ancient ships in here. Even more dangerous um, than the T-Rex one. What, is this it? Oh no, it's, it's right there. Like there's a shipwreck on the beach. Yeah, but there's also a shipwreck here. But it could be the shipwreck on the beach. That's why there's a massive dinosaur and uh, a machine there. Sinking ship. Maybe it has what Harry and Christie need to fix the gyro compass. Okay. That was not what I was expecting. Alright, let's jump out of here. Oh! Is that it? Nope. Got some gold bars. And I'm just using my cheat, my, 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 my jumping cheese. Oh, something there. Couple of bombs. Let's hope the sensor unit is still intact. No sensor unit. There is an old recording. This is the USS Anchorage, hailing anyone who's left. The Medina. The Omaha and the New Orleans are down, and the swarm just cracked the Harris open like an egg. Incoming! Hold on! 
Ah, sounds like they never had a chance. The lead Horus is heavily damaged. If we can concentrate fire, maybe we can still take it down. I think we've got a ping on the Hamilton! Sounds like they're sent to lead us right now. They're trying to reach other ships. I guess I should find the batteries now. That's cool. My focus should pick them up. I just... Well, most of the time I'm just speechless about this game, man. Just... It's just insane looking. There's a little red cross there, I don't know what it's for. Oh, it's... Oh, okay. That makes sense, it's the enemy. It's a machine looking for us. Um, I need to find one more battery, but I don't know... where... Mm, it's not giving me a lot. Take a look inside that shipwreck. See if there's any power sources there. Let's go then. Ah, looks like there is. Look at the the fishy. Sweet. Hey. Focus picked up coordinates from that transmission I found. If there's more shipwrecks there, one might have an intact sensor. Ah, uh, must be the one, um... Oh, no. Oh, okay. It wants me to go all the way there. Wow. Excuse me, salmon. Mm, or fish. Ah, so it can pick me up from the water. Nice! <laughs> like a fish! <laughs> you know how like birds using their crawl to like fly over the water and then grab the fish? Just, it just basically did that to Aloy. So yeah, I still need about 38,000 XP. So this will get me halfway to level 50, and then I'm guessing the um, all the rebel camps and outposts that I'm gonna do will accumulate up to 50, level 50, which is a, a good thing. Well, it's turned into uh, more than a ruin, isn't it? Bloody hell! Imagine the war that went on to basically make human extinct. There's a dreadwing here. Could use fire against it. Okay. So I'm guessing that big massive compound is where I need to uh I'll see if I can with a dreadwing perched on it. Great. Gonna have to deal with it before I can look for the sense of shit. Sends me. Okay, Dreadwing, let's go. Let's party. Where are you? Oh, I can't use my. I can't use my focus. Come on, don't be shy. Jesus Christ! Oh, there you are. No! Oh, you are so dead. You have no idea how dead you are. Um. God damn. I managed to hit his, hit, uh, uh, his weak spot even though I was blinded. No, it was too high. Let's go.
Ah. No, I missed. to use oh now you come back down uh, yeah, I can do another oh it went away again come on come on come on I rushed it I rushed it There you go, fuck you. Okay, I should be able to check out that antenna now. Oh sorry, sorry little piggy. Right. Spew some more arrow. Close. Scorcher scanning ear. Oh, nice. An intact sensor unit. This should be all that Harry and Christie need. All right. Looks like there's one more transmission in here. This is the Hamilton. Anchorage, your transmission has been received. Targeting the lead Horus. Just lost the starboard missile battery. Can't fire. We're empty. Damn it. Captain, there's nothing left to fire. Your orders. Ramp it. course for the Horus chassis. Ramming speed. Ramming speed. Wow. This wind's in a rush. No, so am I. It is incredible though to hear like in the old world when human fighting against machine um, how much they how much they struggle with it and everyone knows that you know soldiers everyone fighting knows that there is no end to it they're just gonna lose and all hopes all hopes of humanity has been put on to this zero dawn project and um, with a selection of capable scientists and stuff like that. It's, it's impressive, it's impressive. All right, a little bit too close. Personal Thank sprays. You. I'll get working on the gyro compass immediately. I'm coming home, Meandra. I'm coming home, coming home. Christy is not the only one with people waiting back home. She'll be able to fix that gyro compass in no time. Nice. We'll never be able to thank you enough, but this should be a start. If you need anything, tell Bohai to contact Alva. I'm sure she can help. May the ancestors steer us true. I'm pretty sure that maybe Gorilla will do a DLC. Hey, complete a two flying mount. Um, I really hope that Gorilla will do a DLC for this game and uh, maybe onto the Quen tribe. Um, because to be honest, they still got maps over here that they can do something, you know, a little bit of space over here that maybe they can do something. Uh, maybe expand the desert, you know, because that this is Las Vegas, so there must be more, right? There must be more to it. Um, yeah, there, there's so many expansion idea that they can do to not only add a little bit more meat into the story that's already pretty very interesting, um, but also to, also to kind of you know, increase the the playtime of this because I want I want more Horizon Forbidden West. <laughs> I want more of this beautiful game. So ladies and gentlemen, there's only two trophies left to do. So the reaching the level 50, the silver trophy, and then also the silver trophy of clearing all the rebel camps and outposts and defeating their rebel leader. So 
Only two quests left to do, two quests, two things, trophy left to do before I reach platinum trophy. So I'm going to do all these rebel camp um, offline and then I'll show slippage of it, highlights of it, and I'll show the last one outpost in the one camp as well. Uh, while doing clearing out the rebel camps, I'll reach level 50, so I'll also show that as well. And that's one to celebrate. So not long now, ladies and gents. So... With that being said, I'm going to crack on with this and I'll see you literally in a split second. You want to melee combat me? Mate, I've beat the Enduring. Ow. Oh, we can't. I'll stop you. Hey, reach level fifty, ladies and gents. There you go, level fifty reached. Seven hundred maximum health. All right, gliding our way through another rebel camp. So this is camp number five out of six. This must be the camp to so after this camp, it will be pretty much the last camp where we also defeat the boss as well. Arisha. Nice. Infiltrated it. Attacking the enemy, going head on isn't exactly a, a good idea since the game isn't designed to do to, to go one against millions. Rebel soldier, I hope they don't have masks, but I think a lot of them might have, which is annoying. Good, I'm in. This place looks like some sort of big site. Oh. If I'm gonna figure out what these guys are up to, I need to find whoever's in charge. There! <sighs> it's just the sound of the headshot is brutal. Well, I know a couple of guys up there. Um, I should really have my Yutaru get up if I want to do stealth. I got I get extra silent strike and silent um silent range. It does look very cold to be honest. What oh, oh mate, this is some splinting cell shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh that was perfect. Nice. Some chill water that I can grab. I've got loads in the stash anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, okay. Not many people. Oh. Hello, champion. Ah, he doesn't know. Bye bye, champion. Oh, mate, that's why I love the sharp shot bow. Oh my goodness me, that was painful.
Okay. Oh, 3,000 with the critical attack. An ancient key. Ah. Oh, I don't have any. All right. Looks like they've been using blades to blast into this place. Sorry, mate. Blaze, you say? Thank you very much, thank you. I've got quite a lot of blaze anyway. Alright, sneaky again, sneaky again. God damn, we got some going good. I missed. Over there! Eyes on! Get here now! Where is that ready? Better start looking. Nah, it's moving too quick. Oh, track shot. Is there, is there more people? Suspend the platform so I can go down more. There's a rebel soldier outside. I was through the fucking helmet, man. There you go. Right, as far as I know, there's only that soldier left. Yeah, there should be. But then when I go down, there will be more. Shards. Not a lot of shards. Oh, okay. God damn, the silent the silent range really makes a difference. Huh. Well, there's no one here. Ah, the blaze. Bunker. Is this what they were trying to get to? Hundred percent. Door looks locked. Maybe this key I found will open it. Nice. Let's see what these rebels are so intent on protecting. Oh, so this is a rebel camp, adding a little bit of flavor from the old world. Love it. There. Uh -oh. oh shit. We have a problem. Smoke bomb. Lost her in the smoke. Oh. Two against one is not very fair, is it? Hey. 
they go. Right. Mano a mano. Mano a mano and you have no match to me, boy. Ah. Got some, f got some fish. Nothing with these. Enemy too close. What? Huh? The fighting music is done, so I'm guessing this is, uh, this cam is basically done as well. So we can go get whoever wanted to kill Aloy. To all engineers and operatives. Return immediately to First Forge. Clearly none of you are competent enough to deal with that blasted Nora. First Forge, okay. I'll have the pleasure of dealing with her personally. Oh, yeah. I wish you luck, Savior of Meridian. Sarah has a base. Sarah. I can find it. I can put an end to the sons of Prometheus. Well, let's see what else is in here. Okay, Aloy just like to climb everything. These scrolls, they're filled with weapon schematics. Different versions of the same thing. None of them complete. Oh yeah, you don't want them to complete. Power cell. I've been experimenting with old world power cells. There's a whole stockpile of them in here. So the sons of Prometheus were trying to build weapons based on ancient technology. Oh, whatever it is. Who uses these power cells? But it doesn't look like they figured it out. Yet. If I destabilize that cell, the explosion would start a chain reaction. And take the bunker with it. No bunker, no power cells, no new weapons. Great. Gonna blow yourself up, Aloy. I only have a few seconds to get out of here before this blows. Time to run. Oh, a cutscene? Oh no. Oh, is that it? Oh, is that it? Oh, what? I kind of wish that uh, I can run it myself. They give me like a countdown and I'll run out. Playing a little bit too safe there, Gorilla. If the Badoop can survive freezing, so can I. Nice. Okay, so now we need to talk to our boy Aaron. Um, he's in the uh, Las Vegas area. I'm running out of fast travel pack as well. God damn. So this is the hidden ember, the Las Vegas of Forbidden West. She's my sister, not an investment. Tell me where she went. Not again. I refuse. So, Las Vegas, how's it going? I've been talking with Morland about how to get the word out about Nemesis up in the claim. The Asaram are free folk. It'll be hard to get them to work together. But him and me, we know a lot of people. We get enough of them riled up, the elder men will have to listen. If anyone can make it happen, it's you guys. I was hoping you could help me with something. It's about the rebel mm -hmm. holdouts, and it also has to do with the Osram. Really? That doesn't sound good. Let me know what I can do to help. I think Silence has been working with a third party to get over the machines to the Danach rebels. The Sons of the Prometheus. A group the Sons of Prometheus. They're familiar with ancient tech, and they're Osram, the anti karja kind. They definitely have a base, a place called First Forge. We just have to find it. First Forge? I think I know where that is. Hell yeah. I was back in Baron Light checking up on the Vanguard when my focus picked up on another one of these, an Osram. I thought it was strange, so I decided to have a little chat with him. When he saw me coming, he ran. Caught up with him, and he tried to crush his focus. But there was still data on it. A bunch of locations and coordinates. One of them was called First Forge. Didn't know what it meant till now. Nice job. Now you know me. He's getting used to the focus. 
Did any of that data mention a woman named Asera? She's the one who's running the group. Oh, no. You remember how Durval had a band of freebooters that retaliated against the Karja? Well, she was one of them. First female tinker in the claim to run her own mm. forge. There you go. But when her family got killed in the Red Raids, she went bad. And real bad. I thought she was dead, though. Taken out by one of Marad's guys. She's not. And she wants revenge against the Karja. But I'm not gonna let it happen. Send me those coordinates, okay? Now hold on, Aloy. I'm coming with you. A Sarah is the last of a line of killers that murdered Ursa. I need to be there when she goes down. Of course. Send me the location and I'll call you when I'm close. All right then. Promise. Promise you'll be in this, Aaron. Remember to send me the coordinates to Asera's base. I'll let you know when I'm close by. I'm sending him now. I won't let you down. I know you won't, buddy. Let's kill this Asera. Alright. Let's get my stash. Stock up. I don't think there's much to stock up on, but... And then we'll go. So this is it, the first forge. Oh, I have unlocked it already. My only got one fast travel pack before I have to stock up again. But this is it. Aaron said we'd find a Sarah's base. I should let him know I'm here. Right. Give Aaron a little hey, call. Aaron. I'm close to a Sarah's base. Think you can join me? On my way. So, you ready to take down some very nasty Asaram? Hell yeah. First we have to figure out a way in. Well, we'll never get it unnoticed. Just have to go in, gun blazing then. Your armor. It's almost the same as theirs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Uh, hey guys, keep up the good work. Who are you? I'm the guy who caught the Nora as Sarah's been looking for, that so. Yeah, we don't know you. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> That's one way to do it. Well, that went well. We should do it more often. <laughs> Oh yeah, Aaron and Aloy. What the hell is his mine? They think they can attack me, but I'm attacking Aloy. them instead. I see them. Oh, wow. Victory? Okay. Ooh, level 40. Oh, wow. Jeez, these, these are hardcore guys. Anything to report? Nice. nice. Ooh. Check it out. Absolutely love it. Oh, there, there's a head on it. Shut up. Oh, you need to have a shot at me first before he dies. Okay, yeah, I need to recharge my stamina. The one bad thing about this Ataru outfit is that um, I don't really have much stamina increase and regen. 50 shards, alright. Damn, I'm getting rich. Okay, more people. Does he have armor on? Yeah, who's that? I don't know, mate. Who's that? Okay, sneaky, sneaky. There's a shield guy there, which is going to be a bit of a problem. Um... Uh, 
He doesn't have a helmet, so that's good. I need to recharge my stamina. I think I've got... Oh, do I not have... No, I don't. Shit. There you go. Okay. Aaron, mate, your your bloody uh, big ass harm hammers in my way. Okay, so they notice something. Low and quiet indeed. Stay in the shadow, Aloy. Stay in the shadow. Okay, no enemies here. Not really a way to go anywhere though. I do have a gun here that I can go gun blazing, but let, let, let's stick to the stealth plan. Aaron, my boy, you can't do anything yet, I'm afraid. Oh. They don't stand a chance. 1,395 damage. Even I don't have that kind of damage. Uh, that kind of health point. Any minute indeed. Sharon, shush. Alright, someone right in front of me, someone right there. Where is he now? I don't know. Helmet, helmet. Oh, they're vulnerable. Hey. Okay, okay, they know. That was a good glide. I'll end this. How is that? There's how is it? There's no explosive. Should have. Alright, the other guys didn't know yet. Alright, there's a couple more guys. There's a guy who just throwing boulders. Great. Great job, mate. Great job. Fucking hell, what was that? Oh, nice. That was a good kill. Do you want to help me out, Aaron, or...? Okay. There's a lot of them left, even though we're trying to, uh, to do stealth. Oof. Oh, mate. Come on, now. That was brutal. Mate, do you want to fuck off? Ah! 
Oh, we missed. There you go, Resonant Blast. Alright, they're pissing me off now. Come on, drink, 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 drink. What? How did that not hit her? What a dodge. That motherfucker keeps fucking blowing me up. You gonna say sorry. Oh, that was a that was a synchronized slam. Fuck off. Well done. I think that's all. Oh, that was sloppy. She has to be here somewhere. I think I saw some doors in the back. Check them out. You saw some door at the back. Let's go. They just kill the bloody boss. Can't be that hard. What was that? Like be careful, Aloy. Sarah really likes her booby traps. And you still like the sound of your own voice, Aaron. Sarah. Using a radio. Make it this far, Nora. If my men were competent as you, I would have wiped out the car job. We have to find a way through. Oh, that's her. I don't really know if I should go to the water or not. It's just uh, I just thought you need to, kind of thing, but. Nice trip wires, but you ain't got me yet. Does look like machine pens. It does. Oh, I can. Uh... Oh, I can get my stash. This must be like a boss battle then. Hey, let's go in the snowy mountain. We can't let you finish what Dirtball started, Asera. This ends here. Funny. I was about to say the same thing. You think you're good? Get him, boy. Here we go. Oh, is that it? Oh. Ow. Okay, she's interfering. There you go, one done. Let me change my outfit. Since you, you're going so serious. Ooh, that's loads of damage. There you go, well done. I removed the, uh, the valuable component too. Good, Aaron. Oh, you got you got a long health bar. I'll give you that.
Mate, just give up. Ooh. I'm gonna... I'm gonna smash you to death. Choking. Ooh. There you go. That's job done. New data point of her complaining about life, probably. Wanting to kill the Kaja. Oh! Snow brought the chill. Hey, got a new bow from her though. A legendary bow. The Sun Sconch. A hunter bow with fire, freeze, and also acid. But she was shooting at me with bloody um, plasma ammo. And I don't get that. Alright, let's talk to Aaron, my boy. And then, pretty much, I think that's it, ladies and gents. You okay? Red raids, and my sister's death, and Sarah's little army. Yeah, it feels like the bloodshed never ends. And the pain it causes. I hope it's really over this time. Me too. But you did good. I'm serious. We couldn't have stopped this without you. Well, I'm glad I could help. For once, I guess. Nah, you always help, Aaron. Should we head back? You go on ahead. I'd like to take a look around first. Oh, look at that sure Sarah didn't leave any storm. surprises behind. Okay. i see you later, then. By the forge, I could use a drink. Defeated Asora. Hey, all trophy obtained. Yes. Woo! Horizon Forbidden West trophy done. And uh, like I said, man, holy shit. 100% trophy done. You know, that's. That's incredible, you know, play this game, started this game on the 18th and uh, a month later I got a platinum. But the game by no means is finished. You see all those exclamation marks? Jesus Christ, there's a lot of exclamation marks. And uh, there's literally still quest after quest and, and it's just so incredibly big this game. It's that it's incredible. Look at look at all the collectibles. I've been through pretty prudent, I guess. Um, getting all the data point, getting all these collectible, all these techs, and uh, wow, look at this. Haven't found many in the world, and there's just so much to offer. And the game progression is only sixty nine percent, which is pretty nice. Alright ladies and gents, so this is the end of Horizon Forbidden West, my first playthrough, just showing you guys what the game can offer, you know, I show you guys a story mission at the start, you know, the start couple missions, and then obviously a lot of side quests and a lot of other, uh, other stuff that you can do, and it has been a pleasure to show you this game, because this game is incredible, it looks beautiful, Aloy is a badass, and just wait until I get into the story, man. It's so juicy, you know, from Zero Dawn to Forbidden West. I learned so much, and the game's still got so much to offer. Uh, I'm going to continue playing this, even though I already 100%ed it. But as you guys, well, 100% is in the Platinum. As you guys just saw, this is only 69% completed. There's still tons and tons of side quests there for me to enjoy. So that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough, enjoyed this series. Click the like button if you did. Subscribe to my channel for more Horizon Forbidden West content and Horizon Zero Dawn content in the future and any other games that I play as well. Stay safe up there, keep calm, and video game. Peace.